A public garden becomes a magic land as Yo-Yo Ma teams up with a garden designer. It's tomorrow afternoon at 25 past four here on BBC Two. Andrew Davis conducts the BBC Symphony Orchestra in the first ever performance of Anthony Payne's realisation of Elgar's Symphony No. 3. It's on BBC Radio 3 on Monday night at half past seven. Fame. I don't know, it's just crazy. It's just... overwhelming. Fame is evil. Fortune. Money, 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 money. I'm thrilled. Fear. Drugs, suicide, anorexia. Now I'm nervous. Insanity. Run. Every Sunday night. It's a big night. The Entertainment Biz. It is the life force of Hollywood. The Entertainment Biz, a new series starting tomorrow, 9.30 on BBC Two. It's just for laughs. An innocent badger watch turns into a gruesome discovery. Jonathan Creek on BBC One in a mo. Uh, we're uh, landing. Do you want to get out of the way? Here he comes. Charlie Sheen in a man's world. <laughs> With a mission in the air and a mission on the ground. Seems no matter what I do, I end up hurting someone. Action, adventure and a lot of explosions. Hot shots Friday at 9 on BBC Two. Careful out there, Lieutenant. I'll be just fine. Now, you might be feeling as though there hasn't been enough sci-fi tonight, so if you're up for it a bit later on, well, it is Valentine's Day, isn't it? Then there's high-tech horror, The Projected Man, here on BBC Two at 5 to 1. It's a love story set in L.A. She's not so young. She'll be 27 in four years. Who are you? It's about personal fear that's always around you. It's a tricky, complicated movie. This character is a real person that's somewhere in all of us. An exclusive interview with Steve Martin, followed by two of his films. The next Saturday from 9 on BBC Two. And... The curling medals are up for grabs. The British women battle for the bronze here on BBC Two in Olympic Grandstand in half an hour. First on BBC Two, highlights of the second day from the third test, the actions introduced by Jonathan Agnew. 